Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, I want to go over something. It's a what if, you know. Um, I just did a video on a video game that's coming out soon. It's like a what if video game. You could, you know, instead of Rick killing Shane, Shane could kill Rick and continue on with the story. A lot of different things you should be able to do with that. It's very exciting as far as what it is, the what if concept. I have done videos like that in the past, the stuff like what if Shane lived and stuff like that. But I was reading through Reddit the other day and came across this one and I thought it was pretty interesting just to think about or talk about or maybe discuss with you guys in some comments. And it was posted by Lamir, L-A-M-I-E-R-R. -R, and it may have been brought up or talked about back when this actually happened in the show, but I, I think some of this is funny. The comments, I'll read some of those to you. And the post says, as fundamental and crucial the barn scene and Sophia's fate is to The Walking Dead and Carol's character. Imagine if instead of that, her status remained unknown until they make it to the Commonwealth and Carol reunited with Sophia in there would have been more rewarding than Yumiko and her brother. Okay, um, I guess I should say spoiler to season 11, but most people seen that. Most people know what's going on, but definitely spoiler to the comic. It was around the time they were introduced to Commonwealth. You remember the board of photos Yumiko saw her brother on it well in the comic it was Michonne and she saw her daughter that was a huge reunion that was a huge thing and it was like an in you know kind of like in the show the brother was kind of a in on the this is what this place is like and I can maybe get you this or that inside here this is how this works so in the comic it was Michonne and her daughter what if you know a lot and in the comments I think it may be is even said or stated that, you know, the barn scene, that was a huge reveal. That was a huge story point. That was a huge scene, a great scene in season two, Sophia coming out of the barn. So we would have had to, you know, rewrote that, redone that, you know, the Shane against Dell, maybe the, of course, Shane against Rick thing would have had to prevailed in the story. And for the theory to work, the what if to work, Sophia would have had to, you know, she couldn't have survived on her, on her own, so she would have had to got picked up by some group, hopefully a decent group, a nice group of people, and then they took her, and maybe they did try to find her mom or the other group, but they were heading in a different direction, and they had to go, hey, we can take care of you, and maybe even the group was heading toward Commonwealth. However it happened, she would have ended up at Commonwealth, and then Carol would have been the one to find her, reunited with Sophia. Wouldn't have that been crazy after all Carol had been through? And jumping into some of the comments, uh, one of the funny ones that's at the top right now, yeah, I agree, but hell, a reunion with Dell's RV would be more rewarding than Yumiko and her brother. I mean, that is just the way it turned out, but I can relate as far as, yeah, Dell's RV, that's funny. One commenter stated that they think the Commonwealth reuniting story should have gone to Aaron and his brother. At least that had more buildup. And that is true. The Aaron and his brother thing totally had more buildup. Aaron had some political type experience that he could have tried or somehow his story fitted into the Commonwealth with Pamela. But it's just a wild theory I wanted to throw out there. Some cool little Reddit thing that I found. A what if. A big what if. And... You know, I love that scene in the barn with Sophia. It would be hard to imagine um, season two without it. Sophia's fate, Carol's journey without Sophia being gone um, and known to be dead instead of just missing. But then when you think about, hey, maybe they never found Sophia and she was missing the whole time. And that's been a mystery in the show all the way up to Commonwealth. And then the big reveal that her daughter is there, Carol's. I mean, what a reveal, especially if she had went through still what she had went through with all the kids through the show, you know, uh, Lizzie Mika and Henry and all of that. And then she finds Sophia. I think it's very intriguing to think about it, to think about that. What if um, it's pretty exciting. It, it would have been more exciting than what we got. I think like like the one commenter said, Dell's RV might have been more exciting. But I also like the way it played out. You know, Sophia, she didn't make it. She was in the barn, that big reveal. You know, I love that as well. So, you know, there's a lot of what ifs all the way through the show that you could say. And, you know, how would that have affected later seasons and stuff like that? It's fun to think about. And really with the what ifs, you can do anything. A lot of people have asked me, hey, what do you think about this? Or do a video on this what if? And really, 
sometimes they have an idea in mind and I can kind of throw them my idea and they're like, well, no, that's not exactly what I was thinking. So the what ifs can really take on any direction you want. You could throw in anything. Anything could happen. So everybody's got their own ideas. That's why it's pretty cool, at least to think about and ponder. Hey, you guys let me know what you think about this one down in the comments below and you know I'll join you there. This is James in Nashville as always. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more dead stuff.